Hi friends, today we are demonstrating a case of very large, huge perianal abscess. What are the tips and tricks in draining such abscesses? First, the site of location is confirmed by palpation and again reconfirmed by pus aspiration needle. The needle is removed then after confirmation and then the incision is taken. Make sure that your incision is always near the anal verge. If you take an incision which is away from the anal verge, the chances that the later on when the fistula formation occurs as a complication of any perianal abscess, it is a long track fistula. So make sure that your incision is always near the anal verge. Now all the abscess material necrotic debris has been drained. Once again we try to break all the locula and septa which is forming the abscess for complete drainage. Since the cavity is huge, we lay open some extra skin so that the drainage is adequate and the chances of fistula formation are minimized. Now for proper hemostasis we give thorough wash and then we try to locate the internal opening. If you are able to locate the internal opening then the chances of fistula formation can be minimized by laying open the entire abscess cavity or doing a fistulotomy. So in this case we are laying open the entire tract of the abscess cavity and we are communicating the abscess cavity with the internal opening at 6 o'clock position which is the most common site. Since for proper hemostasis, this huge abscesses are always having a bleeding tendency. So we are using povidon ointment with compression pack as we can see in this video. This compression pack is been kept in the abscess cavity for 24 hours and stay sutures are taken after keeping this compression pack. Make sure that the compression tail which has been left outside for avoiding missing this compression in situ. So we are compressing this perianal abscess cavity keeping the tail outside and taking temporary stay sutures which will be removed after 24 hours. This will ensure good hemostasis and to avoid profuse bleeding. I am very sure that this video is very helpful for all the beginners or my colleagues as well as people who are contemplating or already having undergone abscess treatment by surgery. This surgery will provide beautiful insights to basic principles of abscess drainage of perineal abscess as well as avoiding fistula and formation by doing a fistulotomy simultaneously.